This is Movie Turn. Leslie Mitchell reporting. Deserted platforms, unused railway tracks. That's the picture on Whit Sunday when drivers and firemen continued their protest strike against new lodging terms. Locomotives piled up in the yards and the confusion, of course, spread to the whole railway timetable in regions affected. King's Cross Terminus was a scene of desolation. Special notices were used to cope with the situation. One or two trains which did leave proved that there were some drivers not in sympathy with the strike. Here's one man's opinion. I've been a driver on these jobs for practically 20 years. I consider the logging job to be better than they used to be. I consider this strike was not justified, as it's letting the country down and also the public down. It's essential that these jobs should be worked, and I consider this never ought to have happened. And it could have been avoided if the men had gone the right way about it. Objection is taken by the strikers to the hostels in which men are lodged on long distance halls. It's said that there are 96 men involved. The railway executive claims, however, that accommodation is quite good. This hostel at Kentish Town has figured in the dispute. At least the beds seem to be comfortable, 